Beth, and what on earth are you doing? I've got claw hand. This is new to me. Claw hand, let me in. Claw is this a new hand. Thing? Have you never had claw hand before? Is this like a new fashion or something? I don't know if it's fashionable. I'm not particularly feeling that cool right now. I think I've just basically got a little bit of RSI. Ah, uh, yes. Too much mouse? Too much mouse. Yes, that's uh, unfortunately mouse. common. I'm sure there's plenty of out there who've had the same <laughs> issues before. I too have suffered from this. And do you know what my solution was? Mm -mm. My desktop. Yeah, I know, but I'm always at my desktop, so... No, I've... no, 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 no. My desktop, it's the application, it comes part, as part of my cloud. I know you've heard of this. I my have cloud, heard, I have, cloud. I know my cloud, okay, I know so my you, cloud, but what's so you, my desktop? So you've got your ASUS Transform, uh -huh. right? And you've got the my cloud application, you must have seen there's a my desktop button. And uh -huh. that allows you to take full control of your desktop. Wow. From your transformer. So I have, I can just control my desktop from yeah, wherever it's, it's, I am. It's right there, so you've got... You've got, you can see on your, on your tablet, you can see the screen, and most importantly for you, you can control it using the touch screen rather than having to use a mouse. So instead of having your hand like this, you know, you can have your, your hand out and you'll find that it should help you recover. That's great, because I've got, obviously, some applications on my PC that are not on my tablet, so... Yeah, I mean, Android's great, um, but it's not compatible in the, in the same sense, you know. A lot, you can, there's a lot of crossover, there's a lot of different apps, but yeah, some of the things you might need are going to be on your desktop. And what about and this speed? Allows you to do that. The actual app, all it has to do is transmit what's on your screen. So you, you, it doesn't use the, pr the processor inside your tablet. So if you've got stuff that's really intensive that's running on your desktop, you're still going to get those speed advantages. And being over Wi-Fi, it's, it's really nippy. It should kind of feel like you're using the desktop. This really. is a lazy RSI sufferer's dream. Sounds pretty cool, Spode, but I would like to see this in action. Well, for that, Bethan, we're going to have to go to, to the, the lab. lab. I have it installed on my, on my desktop, all my desktops actually, and, and then from my tablet I can control all of them at the click of a button. I just have to put my password in and I can take control of them and it's great, really handy. Because I guess even if like, even if I was just sitting in bed and I hadn't planned to use it, I could, if my computer is on, yeah. surely I can just be like, oh yeah, I, I mean, need to I get mean, that. When you're not using it, it just sits in the background and it idles and it's not doing anything. But when you want to get access to it, I mean, I probably only use it once a month, mm. but it's really good to know that that option is there. Yeah. I mean, it's only on your Wi-Fi network as well. So, you know, you're not going to get people trying to hack into you from, a, from across the internet in some strange country. So... Cheers for that advice. All this time it was right under my nose and I didn't even know. So hopefully by this time next week I'll have a very happy hand. Hopefully, Let's yes. Hope. It does take a while to cure from RSI though. But maybe with the massage. I'm not offering. I think I'm, I'm going to go and do it after this. So anyway, if you would like to see any more top tips from the lovely Spode or myself, then please stay tuned for more future episodes. You can subscribe on YouTube or iTunes. And of course, we have our lovely forum over on Tech and Style where you can get really involved in the community and you can tell us all about your RSI problems there. We would love to hear your comments, so stay tuned. See you soon. Why do cats prefer desktops? I don't know why. It's because they like mice. Oh my god.